open arms. We are ecstatic about performing and being in the motherland. Like you said earlier, it feels like home. So we are blessed to be here, number one, for the first time, but also amongst such great talent as well. And we've been rehearsing very high because that's what we do, but we want to give our best here the first time in Uganda. So I'm very excited to share with you all what we've been working on from the classics, the hit records, but also brand new music. And I'm here to answer everybody's questions. I can't wait to celebrate with you and have lots of fun, but um, we're, we're extremely looking forward to it. So thank you for welcoming us. I've been doing what I love since I was a little girl. I come from a very musical family and I met love and passion for music. Number one is music. Uh, I've always been attracted to music and how it's made me feel and let that be the driving force, but also people. You know, it takes more than just yourself. It takes a great team of agents. It takes a great team, thank you Brad, for bringing us out here. It takes a great team of, of management, of other artists, from musicians to dancers to producers to publicists, you know, to support you properly, but I do this for the love of music, but also bringing people together at the end of the day, and I think that's what's kept me uh, strong in a very, very fickle business, but uh, here in Uganda, I'm so excited about the performance, of course, and we're going to be in rehearsals prior to, just making sure things are perfect, um, but I, I don't know, do you guys have any things that you think I should see while I'm here? There's times I probably need like two weeks to to get a taste. <laughs> I have to meet some Uganda artists. Um, my favorite right now is Katuja, Katipitusi. Yes, and uh, Rena. It's a beautiful song and video, by the way. It's vibes all day long. So. You know, being that I play in the soca, reggae, and dance hall space, I mean, this is where all the rhythm originates. So it's only right that I either come back or make some time, set some time aside to uh, collaborate with a Ugandan artist. Yes, I hope to see some perform too. Thank you. I lead a very healthy lifestyle. I, I don't drink soda anymore alcohol and uh, lots of fruits, lots of vegetables, and I'm vegan. So that's definitely um, contributed to staying youthful. Organization that I work with called Africa.org, and they service 40 countries in Africa. And uh, I've worked with them since about... Uh, there's an organization named AfriCare, and they can be found at africare.org online that I've been working with since about 2009. And they service 40 nations throughout Africa in water sanitation, education, and health, women's health as well, as well as building clean systems. So I'm pretty sure that uh, Uganda is one of the places that they've been on foot with as well as serviced in the past and present. So I'm proud to be a part of that organization as well and represent them from Washington, D.C. Mm -hmm. When I got nominated for the Grammys, it was amazing. Uh, my entire independent project, Smooth Jones, was nominated and that was unexpected. It was a big surprise, but it was also confirmation to keep doing what I love and always operate in my creation process uh, from a place of just doing what makes you feel really good. Mm -hmm.